Hamida Qutb. Hamida dedicated her life to enlightenment and empowerment. Born in 1937 at the village of Mosha in Egypt, Hamida was raised in a very religious family which included her father al Hajj Qutb al-Ibrahim, mother Swaliha and siblings Sayyid Qutb, Muhammad Qutb, Amina Qutb, Nafisa and Shawqi. Following their father's death, the family moved to Cairo where Sayyid was pursuing his higher studies. Their mother died shortly afterwards. Like her brother Sayyid, who proved to be a literary talent, Hamida also showed similar potential. She published her articles in the newspaper of Ikhwan al In 1954, Sayyid Qutb was sentenced for imprisonment for 15 years. Following the Manshia incident in 1965, the whole family was arrested and underwent harsh punishments. Hamida was imprisoned for 10 years, charged for working as an agent between Sayyid Qutb and Zainab al Ghazali, and for her contribution in the book Milestones by Sayyid Qutb. During her solitary confinement in Harbi jail, she memorized the Holy Quran. The ninth Sayyid Qutb was to be hanged. The jail officials summoned Hamida Qutb to convince her brother to change his mind. However, Hamida refused, even though her brother's life could be saved. After six years of imprisonment, Hamida Qutb married Dr. Hamdi Mas'ud and left for France to complete her graduation in Arabic and history. She was engaged in preaching Islam and authored several books in French until her death on July 13, 2012.